obviously it's the, the culmination of a season's you know, hard work and uh, you know we're looking forward to the occasion on, on the weekend uh, you know, we're, we're in confident mood as a group and you know we're coming off the back of two great performances so we just need to remain focused on the job and uh, you know continue to work hard and hopefully we can perform well on the weekend you know, throughout the year it's been a tough one we've faced some difficult challenges and obstacles some we've fallen at but um, you live to fight another day and Thankfully, like I said, we find ourselves here now and, and um, just really looking forward to it. I think there's no pressure on us at all. Nobody expects us to win, so let's come and give it our best shot and, and uh, enjoy Saturday night. Yeah, I mean, I can understand, obviously, people asking the question about previous grand finals. You know, obviously, we've been defeated in them and, and that is part of our history, but uh, hand on heart, I can honestly tell you that we, we haven't spoken about 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 those defeats all year. Royce hasn't mentioned them. Yeah, it's just about doing well this year. And, you know, as a group, we're focusing on focusing on that. And uh, to be honest, they haven't given the last few years too much consideration. I, th I think we can't save it for another day. Um, we don't want any ifs, muts, or, uh, ifs, maybe's or buts. Come Saturday night after the event. Um, but that's how we've had to approach the last couple of games. Like I said, nobody believed in us. We've had to go away from home in the last two playoff games so um, we've gone to the fortress of Warrington as well at weekend and uh, managed to get a victory there so uh, the guys are confident but look we'll just come here and do our best and we're training with it really well um, the squad's in a really good place it's happy um, you know, it'd be great to finish the season off with a bang. Maybe it has been a transitional year too, but there's no saying that you can't do well in a transitional year, and especially when you've got quality players like we have. Uh, you know, the likes of you know James Roby, James Graham in the middle of the field have been fantastic for us, and uh, you know C. C. S. Eliol, but he's been immense for us also. And then you're throwing around them the young players who've come in, and you know they they hold no fear with you know these types of occasions. They just get in there and do the job and. Uh, you know, I think we've benefited from that, uh, and you know everybody's enjoying playing for each other. You played your way to a f your fair share of these uh, these grand finals. How does the preparation and, and the the form you've got going into this one stack up against against your past appearances here? Um, well, it's different because, um, like I said, normally we've come on a different different path, a different route. Uh, I'm not saying it was easier, but. Um, this one is, is certainly special because of what's happened to us in the year. Um, the fact that we're playing well and we beat some good sides, well, you have to do that to get here. Um, you know, we're just delighted that we managed to beat some very good teams. We come up against another great team on Saturday. We have to find our best performance of the year. But we'll do that uh, with a smile on our faces and, and give it our best shot. Yeah, I mean, you Certainly, you know you approach these games and you you don't leave anything in the tank, do you? There's nothing, there's, there's nothing you can do next week about you know these types of games. This is the last game of the season, so you give it, you give it your everything, and uh, it's important for us as a group. We, we work hard in training, just work on the preparation of what we need to do to perform well on the weekend. And if we do that, uh, you know we feel we've got performance in us to win the competition. You're no stranger to to Old Trafford. What's it like walking out here the tunnel and? The fans filling the filling the stadium. What, what's that like? What's it like as a spectacle? Oh, it's, uh, there's nothing like it. Um, you know, perhaps I'm biased because I've not won at Wembley, but uh, to walk out here when it's dark and the fireworks are going off, um, it's, uh, there's nothing like it. It's just memories that you'll keep forever. But when you come out of that tunnel and there's all that noise and you know the the ground split and red and white and Blue and amber, it's. Uh, I know it's like coming out into a gladiatorial arena. It's just, it's it's hard to explain, but it's uh, the feeling you get when you walk out that tunnel. There's nothing like it. It's it's, uh, it's brilliant.